Hey friends, how's it going? Uh, welcome to this episode. Today we are going to be installing a brace. Um, I think we are going to be activating more grip because that's what happens when you install braces. It's got nothing to do about your tires and shit. Um, so let's see what we got. I um, Because I bought my car in November, and November is such a special month, I got a voucher for Repco and Repco sells white line products. So I just ordered in this brace. I'm struggling really hard to hold the camera and open this. Anyway, it's a lower control arm brace. You can see, I'm pretty sure it's these two go on the lower control arms and these go into the chassis. I have no idea. I've never installed one of these before. So it's gonna be a learning experience for everyone. Um, it's gold, uh, which is nice. And it's a four point, which is also nice. Um, I feel like two point, undercar bracing does little to nothing. Um, that's just my experience with it. Um, Alright, so we're going to try and install it. I'm going to be winging it. I don't really know what I'm doing. Alright, so I got the car hoisted up on stands. That's the brace there. I got down the packaging. It's nothing special to look at. Now, I'm trying to figure out where exactly it's going to go. Yeah, get the camera in there. I believe going to bolt on there. Let me just fix up the focus. I can't see shit. Yeah, so that's your little control arm there. So from what I can understand, it bolts just here and then here, maybe. Um, or is it that thing? I think it bolts there. Yeah, it bolts up against that. And then this. Let's go grab the uh, brace and see if that's right. All right, so these are the tools you need. Just a 17 and a 19 and that's it. So we'll get under there and see if we can make it work. So there's your lower control arm. That's where the first bolt comes out, just there. And then the other one comes out there. So you can see I've taken out both sides now. Some great camera footage right here. Upside down and blurry and shit. So now I'm also squeezing under here with the brace. So we'll chuck the brace in and that's just doing reverse. So using the bolts here. God, I'm good at camera work. Alright, so I just finished wrestling the um, the bar onto the car. It was, I guess it's a good thing. You want the bar to be pretty tight and and uh, not have much slack in it. Will have any slack, so I guess it's a good thing. But I just meant it was a bit hard to wrestle it into shape and get it on there. But let me just get down here. As you can see, the bar is now on. Looks pretty good. So you don't have the cover going across your um, gearbox there, but that's okay, I guess. So yeah, fit, fit pretty good in the end. Just a bit of a struggle to get it on there in the first place. And now we'll take it out for a drive and see how much of a difference it's made. All right, so I've got my GoPro set up. Um, they say the best way to test your suspension is go get KFC. So we're gonna do that. Front end seems a little bit more direct. Uh, let's see if we can find some good corners. Seems to want to turn in a bit more as well, which is good. Getting more of a, a point, point and shoot feeling. Because I did 
find prior to this, the, um, this car does kind of feel a bit wallowy in the front. Um, sort of feels like each strut's doing its own thing. You can feel the flex in the front end because they don't have a subframe in the front. pretty well it's not too expensive it's like two three hundred dollars for the brace um, install it took me half an hour and that was just because I was struggling a bit to get it to fit on there how I wanted it to but yeah like the cut in it, it just goes where you want it to now it just is so direct um, I, I definitely recommend this mod I, and it's easy to install pretty cheap makes a huge difference I rate it. So thanks so much guys for watching another video. Uh, let me know if you like this sort of content or what you want to see. Um, I did say to myself this year I will start doing some videos of my friends cars and other people's cars in the Sydney car scene. So doing like ride alongs and having a look at what they've done. So I'll be starting those hopefully soon. But yeah definitely let me know what you think and if you like the video give us a like and a subscribe. Thanks for watching guys. I'll talk to you later.